जय जय मेरो गोपाल जय जय गोविंद जय जय मेरो गोपाल जय जय राधा रमण हरि गोविंद जय जय राधा रमण हरि गोविंद जय जय राधा रमण की चरण शरण बिन राधा रमण सुंदर नील शरणागत वत्सल भव मोचन शरणागत भक्ति युक्त हो करिए दर्शन भक्ति युक्त हो दूर हो सबता दूर हो सब की चरण शरण बिन राधा रमण की चरण लीला मधुर रसमयी सुंदर लीला मधुर रसमयी समय समय की आस्वादन कर समय समय की जागे हृदय बीच प्रेमांकुर जागे हृदय करो नाम का जाप करो नाम का जाप हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे 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 कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे श्री कृष्ण जय तन्य प्रभु नित्यानंद हरे कृष्ण हरे राम श्री राधे गोविंद श्री कृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभु नित्यानंद हरे कृष्ण हरे राम राधे गोविंद हरि बोल 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 हरि गोविंद जय जय मेरो गोपाल जय जय गोविंद जय जय गोपाल जय जय ओ राधा रमण हरि महाराज की जय बोलो गुरु महाराज की जय बोलो सब संतन की जय सो भक्तन की जय 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 श्री राधे Bitte die Kopfhörer aufsetzen und ausprobieren wenn jemand nicht hören kann, einfach die Hand heben, dann können wir kurz helfen. Alle hören gut? Okay, danke. Everybody has to think in advance about their own life. The scripture says, according to the age, increase your age by 30, 40, 50, 60, whatever looks convenient. And see that at that time, what a person will need most. 
people are many temperaments are many different ways to look at life but the thing is that everybody has to reach the same point later on that is everybody will need peace and satisfaction in the chest so brahme murte uthaye the first thing in the morning a person should get up sit in bed and think about how you how to accumulate peace today so therefore the sadhana comes but when a person is doing sadhana then in that he sh- he can attach purpose that out of the sadhana peace will get invoked and from peace satisfaction will come so when we attach a purpose to an activity then that activity will bring that purpose so jap tap vrat the tapas of all the pranayam and uh, asan mantra chanting fasting scripture reading all this together then they are very much focused upon giving peace and satisfaction to human being so this is the research in the morning and in the night time evaluation that am i being able to collect 10 grams of peace today or not research in the morning and evaluation in the night this way the thought process of human being will be specific will have a direction in life so something called dhyan in the in the process of yoga dhyan dharana dhyan samadhi dhyan dhyan means first person is focused that in active every activities he is finding his destination that this thing this person this place this thought this ambition this desire is taking me to taking me to my destination or not dhyan what is in your head you look outside so research in the morning and evaluation in the evening this way the thought process of human being the texture will be very strong and it will now it will not let a person fall down in his feelings ever in life like you see there are many types of clothes available in market so one person went to buy pants one pers- the one pant was cheap one was very expensive both were cotton so the buyer said that to the shopkeeper that this cotton is cotton you know why you are selling so expensive so the shopkeeper said this this cheap one does not have much research behind it threads may come out or this way that way no guarantee but the other expensive pant unless you take a scissor and you want to cut it that is a different story but that much guarantee that if you fall down somewhere your your back may break but pants will not and if you really take care of the pant your child will wear it also and in families people do that you know because nice coat nice jacket nice pants and they run from one generation to next no problem so texture the texture of the thought holds the situation of a human being's feeling otherwise feeling is just liquid going here there getting spilled getting kaput but the texture holds it of thought so coming back to yesterday the king and he slipped in his ego the ego made him put a snake in the neck of his stage he repents 
he he does not lose time he goes in the shelter of knowledgeable wise in the shelter of wisdom and he says my question is about present moment how to decorate it an answer came that no need to decoration for decoration everything is decorated but only the ego is looking so that is the problem so <clears throat> one lady and she was sitting on on her sofa sipping coffee from behind suddenly somebody came and pulled her hair so she was angry she looked back and then she saw it was this was her her child a small child so she, the anger went away and love came and she hugged the child and said my naughty child my naughty child so husband was looking from behind after 10 minutes he comes and the lady arranged her hair back after 10 minutes he comes and he pulls the hair of his his wife just like the child did so lady lady is saying that my naughty child did it again he she did not even look back and then saying this she turned back and this was this time was her husband not the child so this brought anger and she was very upset and she said that you you disturb my dignity and this that and they quarreled and fought and the you know she said i want divorce tomorrow first thing in the morning i want divorce tomorrow so they both land in the court the judge asked the lawyer what is the case the lawyer said sir as you know the dignity of a lady is her hair and he pulled it the man and and he disturbed the dignity of the lady so she wants to separation this is the case so judge said judge <coughs> asked the husband that did you pull the hair of your lady of your wife she said yes so he asked him, what gave you this idea I means how you got this idea to pull the hair of your lady so he said sir the thing happened that for past 6 months she has not spoken to me we have been only talking on email and texts so i was feeling lonely and i i just saw this incident that my child our child came and pulled her hair and she hugged her hugged the child and said my naughty child and everything and i imagine that if i also pull her hair she will also hug me <laughs> but she wants to separate the same activity is 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 is, is drawing embrace the same activity another person is drawing separation so now judge shifted to the lady and she said that your child pulled your hair she said yeah you are not angry you no know why oh because my child so judge said child is yours your husband is not yours judge threw a question lady was silent and she silent till today and judge said i reserve the case i reserve the judgment the day lady will answer so case is still reserved because ego does not let answer so this is just a story a situation that where when ego looks this is rejection when love looks this is acceptance the same pulling of hair is bringing embrace the same pulling of hair is bringing separation distance so the better choice is let love look at not ego because 
life is not much you know means it people think we we have a long life but it goes like a flicker it's not much and in this if somebody says oh what are you doing nowadays oh, i'm trying to find a friend you ask another person what are you doing oh, i'm trying to work out my separation and this only life will go so therefore tasmad bharat sarvatma bhagavan ishwaro hari श्रोतव्य कीर्तितव्यश्च स्मर्तव्य स्वेच्छता भयम देर फॉर नॉट वेस्टिंग टाइम एंड भागवतम इज इज एवेलेबल फॉर ह्यूमेनिटी इट्स देयर एंड टेक्स एंड द स्क्रिप्चर इज समथिंग विच इज मैन टेस्टेड इज टेस्टेड बाय मैन एंड इट इज ओके मीन्स if suppose you you chanting mantra you saying om for example this is really is a sound from divine or no it is just man made both way it is good if it is divine is we accept it is divine sound nothing like it but if some man experimented behind this and found found out that this is the sound which gives peace stability this is even better because man believes in man this thing benefited the other guy this will benefit me also it is both way it is good man made or god made it doesn't matter but everything is creator made everything is god made man just finds it om was traveling in the air one day a man found it just like he found diamond from the earth this is the diamond from the air govind jay jay mero gopal jay jay mero radha raman hari govind jay like for example you are in this yoga course in your house if somebody tells you do this don't do this you will be upset in 2 minutes <clears throat> but here you are here listening to do's and don'ts for a month and you paid for it also <laughs> there's another tragedy <laughs> <laughs> that you pay to listen to do and don'ts maybe you focused on this point or maybe not even if your friends call you too much here you will say i'll talk to you next week but here right from 6 o'clock in the morning till night do's and don'ts and happily you are listening there is no protest inside you also why because the scripture is going inside is creating a situation the love consciousness is taking over your head and the level of acceptance is enhanced the level and sometimes you see that you cannot do asana properly cannot do pranayam properly and then this sanskrit you have to remember ya kundendu tushar har dhavla and you break your head this is my destiny you know to remember this means what it has to do with yoga this is kundendu no. <laughs> what is as you without sanskrit can i do yoga I cannot it's not possible so even that hardship of remembering twisting your tongue sanskrit you know t- sanskrit a lot of tongue twisting but for germans sanskrit is very easy because as in german language is in the sentence the verb can be put at any you can put it in beginning middle and anyways your freedom 
Similarly, in Sanskrit also you can put the verb in the beginning and middle any, anywhere. If you do the same thing in English, the meaning changes. But in Sanskrit German, 80% grammar is same. Therefore, for Germans, yoga is easy. Because <laughs> Sanskrit. But also you see the, the, the Upanishads in Sanskrit, they were first translated into French. The first translation was in French, not in Sanskrit. In French, you see something and pronounce it as something else. In German, whatever you see, you pronounce that. Oh. In French, in Sanskrit also, whatever you see, you pronounce that way. But this is called Thibault. He translated first thing into French, Upanishad. That must be even harder, you know, for a, from Sanskrit to French, and for a French scholar, do this. But whenever a person will come in contact of scripture, it dissolves ego. It's an inborn magic sitting inside scripture. And when ego is dissolved, the inborn element of human being comes up, that is love consciousness. That's what we are, love consciousness. Who we are, we are not the rejection makers, we are the acceptance maker. We are not the complaint maker and playing enemy to life, but we are service maker to life, nurturing it, taking care, we, we are caretakers of life. Just like the mother which is in full element with love consciousness towards child accepts child as it is. And if there is something lacking in the child, she wants to serve, serve the child and make it better. She is not, taking, she is not after taking faults of child or criticizing child, never. In whichever way child behaves towards the mother, some, some, some children misbehave, they beat the mother also. But mother, mother's eye towards the child is full of love only, acceptance only, service only, caretaker. So, stepping into the field of scripture. Sometimes you can't do yoga so good, asanas, pranayam cannot learn that Kundain do so good. But side by side what happening that you cannot do so well but you are accepting it and you are practicing that thing and making your uh, observe, observe, uh, observation of that asana better. You yourself are looking at yourself and you can see your faults, but you do not criticize yourself for that. You accept as you are, but you try to make yourself better at the same time. This is looking at oneself through the eye of love consciousness. And this, this goes on for a month. The love consciousness hidingly is working inside. That brings the capacity in you to listen to do's and don'ts for a month. But the only loss happens when people step out of TTC, means when it's over. Then everything is left behind and what was earned in one month goes waste. Person is very sensitive toward do's and don'ts, so nobody can tell me what to do, what to do, this, that. You know. But hold on to this scripture because this is the only friend which made you so capable, which enhanced the level of acceptance and made you capable to look at life and not finding faults in it. If there's something like lacking, serve serve it and make the situation better. And in a relationship between we versus things, we versus place, we versus people, if there is all possibility to break up but does not break up, this is love consciousness. 
proof the proof of that is the outlook of our heart towards us whatever we do however kaput we make a day but heart is on this is philosophy of love consciousness where mind will get fed up brain will get fed up other organs will get fed up but heart is on this is a proof here means we can look at this religiously the god is accepting us we can take it just medically that this is a muscle it never gives up but the muscle has a behavior you know the muscle has a behavior it's inborn in us one the heart from one person can be transplanted to another another person who never gives up the unconditional the love where a relation is unconditional what will come back is not the question that the heart says i will be on my element this is karma complete in itself is not re- the activity of heart is not reaction based is action based whatever is the persona personality ideal element philosophy of heart it stays on it and the whole scripture we listen and sadhana and everything is just the effort to synchronize our thinking with the thinking of heart it takes ages गोविंद जय जय मेरो गोपाल जय जय मेरो राधा रमण हरि गोविंद जय जय विधि निषेध मय कलि मनहरनी करम कथा रवि नंदनी body has evoluted to the maximum there is no more means is developed completely that area finished but the understanding towards life how to look at this life how to relate how to connect with the present moment that situation is not evoluted in everybody and a human being does not want to attach his understanding with love consciousness that's why humanity has crisis today that's why dogs are saving humanity cats are saving birds are saving this mountain this tree grass river ocean this is saving humanity if this was not there everything will be burned very fast so <clears throat> तस्वाद भारत सर्वात्मा भगवान ईश्वर हरि ही द डायलॉग बिटवीन द किंग एंड द एंड द सेज सो नाउ यू सी ऑन द ऑन द स्ट्रेंथ ऑफ द स्क्रिप्चर यू आर ट्राइंग टू मेक योर सेल्फ बेटर इन योर आसन प्राणायाम फिलोसॉफी संस्कृत यू डोंट क्रिटिसाइज योर सेल्फ यू डोंट रिजेक्ट योर सेल्फ you don't give up and but this this is freedom you're not looking for sympathy this is can somebody can come can come on cry you know on my this yogic situation but if you remove yourself out of this attention disorder nobody is seeing for the last 10 days i am upset of course in the second week of the ttc you are upset but that is that is you know when a system is we are when you entering system the system checks you know purification the purification and that makes the mind upset the body is not upset at all you know this is beauty that your body is never upset only the mind or only a particular type of understanding we are in bondage of that understanding is upset what is not so as we improve ourselves this this is evolution you know this is evolution that we 
we we we want to a person want to test oneself to the yogic scripture let's say yoga sutra so one is trying to attach oneself to the posture to the mudra of an asan asan and the and the posture of pranayam also let's say two things the two things only is a big it's a big defeat for ego like somebody says that am i being you know will somebody tell me how to sit down this is ego even somebody will tell me how to breathe another ego and somebody will i have to eat what i am given or i have choice what is given or can i not sleep till 8 o'clock one after another but is a is a removal of ego slowly slowly but again a scripture has such thing that person makes complaint but side by side accepts also this is magic this is the magic of scripture that is making shouting whatever is upset whatever but side by side accepts also okay okay i will do this i will do six o'clock i will do this chapati i will do this i will do this pranayam i will do this asana this is no problem kundendu accepting side by side and in this evolution this purification happening from love consciousness taking over and ego going away so when this process is happening side by side what is also appearing in the chest of a human being satisfaction tushti pushti kriyonnati the the karma should be that or action or engagement should be that that while doing it one is feeling satisfied while doing it not after effect doing it where you are saying om while saying om you feeling satisfied that's why the acceptance comes because the biggest discomfort in this life is the dissatisfaction in the chest the discomfort is not coming that because the chair is not comfortable or this or that you are sitting on the ground you don't have a chair but it did not come to your head also i am not sitting on the chair it was such a comfortable space in your chest this yoga gives this no complaint did not even come to attention <clears throat> so side by side the satisfaction takes over in the chest and peace of course every drop of blood forget about mind every drop of blood is happy because there is no stress which is being uh, superimposed or imposed by ego because ego wants performance ego wants more and more out of one it wants 5000 you know that crosses very trouble some straight for the drop of blood is stressed and stretched every drop of blood every cell in this body very peaceful very comfortable and then when one looks in the mirror and he looks in his eyes the the shape of the eye will be like lotus petal the lotus petal that's why the lotus lotus asana is the king of asana you know because the right posture has taken over the mood of a person this is the fruit of yoga that a person says that my body is in this water like a lotus but my fa- my consciousness my feeling is just above you know lotus position lotus position my body is in it but my feeling is above not attached lotus leaf but that shape i takes i takes the shape of that and whenever you look in the mirror you look in the in your eyes lot of satisfaction calmness stillness stability everything and through the door a person enters one's own chest because that's where the feeling guy is there 
and next to heart next to divine this person says this is where i live actually this is where my belonging is i am as i am that i can do a little more or this or that or that all these outer things they are gone but the inside reality takes over where name and form name and form actually doesn't matter when is a matter of feeling the name and form doesn't matter any person got the beautiful gift or of accepting himself bypassing the mind and the brain if one stands on the ground of brain and say and checks that am i achieved person brain will say no you did not create any big expansion physically in life kaput then one is stands in the on the on the ground of mind and checks one's success mind says you are complete failure you could not fulfill my desires this is where the disappointment comes in life because the ground is mind or brain ego or desires so therefore when sitting in sadhana attaching to scripture and this is making a person bypass the ego and the desires of this mind and brain and direct direct ground where we are standing upon heart what is making us stand heart how can you sit down heart how can you understand the beauty of music heart of whatever you know the beauty of whatever how can you understand heart once upon a time there was a philharmonic orchestra playing in a big hall and a very knowledgeable person with music music knowledge musicologist you know musicology here knowledge about music sitting with black suit and this and tie and bow and everything enjoying opera and one seat was empty next to him and then suddenly he felt somebody came and sat there and he turned and he saw that it was a small deer a small deer made his way into the thing and sat on the seat and listening to opera with closed eyes and this man this man said oh this is for this is opera for human beings not for animals but whether body is human form or animal form but heart is same the heart is same therefore the stone also has a heart trees also have heart ocean has a heart the whole nature has a heart animal has heart birds have human being of course and music affects the heart inside every situation because the knower of music is sitting in the heart of that deer and of that black bow and suit guy also brain is not necessary you know when this beautiful movie came sound of music if you have not seen you should see for, for music <clears throat> very knowledgeable people about music they were singing the songs a rickshaw puller was also singing in india <laughs> every level was singing those songs the music takes over songs are simple i am 16 going on 17 i am 16 going on 17 so what's great about it music words no value but what is behind the music is this is a situation where soul takes over and body remains behind many many 
good thinkers they were not good to look at very ugly but their writings their dialogue and everything is most beautiful they they still they bring the most beautiful situation in human feeling till to today because name and form didn't matter when the philharmonic takes over govind jay jay mero gopal jay de mero and this composer of this music of this film he used to live 6 months on ship and he's getting his inspiration from the ocean and composing music and 6 months he will come in the city and make the music for 6 months disappear so today's life the appearance is biting the humanity so much one needs one wants to be seen everywhere all the time fear of missing out fomo it's called fomo fear of missing out but there is a uh, this lady and she writes a script of films and she got very high award about for a script of a film so in her acceptance speech she said that disappear for some time and see what happens disappear from wanting to be seen everywhere all the time wanting to know everything from everywhere disappear and then see what happens because at some point there has to be a dialogue with, with with the soul with the heart of this person or no the life will pass in form only fear of missing out but why this form or because you only live once yolo <laughs> you only live once you know as if the life is between is is a pendulum between fomo and yolo and it is so <clears throat> a person through with the scripture the acceptance level enhanced and accepts himself uh, separate from desires and ego and the dialogue is on with heart and one is able to love oneself one is able to love oneself this is satisfaction everybody is full of complain oh he uh, i don't i'm not loved he doesn't love she doesn't love nobody loves depression comes but the thing is in first place you love yourself first place love yourself oh nobody giving attention to me oh first in first place give attention to yourself aap dirdham na jananti katham mokshi bhavet priye where there is all everything in this heart a person is searching outside so therefore every minute a person will spend in scripture scriptural teaching sadhana everything practices a person is standing on the ground of his heart the real place he is able to accept and love himself and with that satisfaction in the chest then a person will look at this life imagine the degree of acceptance it will be like a a mother is looking at 100 children of hers imagine you no know, like vasudhai va kutumbakam so in india in scripture there is a saying that the whole world whole universe is one family whole universe what situation is different no problem at least one person can look like that this is for a person how a person looks at this life that that's what matters for every everybody wants own feeling towards the 
सिचुएशन इज द वर्ल्ड टू हिम सो वेन दैट कनेक्शन comes with the with the with the situation with the world with the whatever then love consciousness only looks ego doesn't look because disappointment depression meaninglessness alienation feeling alienated loneliness or so many other types of diseases they come only from this because man is searching for acceptance of himself but actually he has to accept himself no need to come this acceptance from outside and one can think very medically very plain simple logic the whole system of my is standing on my heart nobody can deny it and the the function of heart is a philosophy of love unconditional it gives not thinking about taking back and if i have if i have lived a faulty day the heart will beat little extra serve the situation and purify tomorrow the same if a person attaches once behavior with the behavior of heart that's it he is in a real ground acceptance so when in life there is there is nectar of love consciousness is available why a person is after drinking the poison of ego whether it is a painting whether it is a name whether it is appearance but the story has to be of acceptance and surrender otherwise painting is no good and music is no good appearance is no good name and form nothing is good this ego is burning this life but also there is available the cool shade of the tree of love consciousness it is choice for human being he wants to go under the tree or not and standing on the ground of love consciousness only we can have, we can accept ourselves there is no other ground we can accept ourselves the chant for few minutes param dhan radha jay radha jay radha param dhan radha jay radha param dhan radha jay radha jay radha param dhan radha jay radha jay radha hamaro dhan radha jay radha jay radha hamaro dhan radha हमारो मन राधा जय राधा जय राधा हमारो धन राधा जय राधा हमारो धन राधा जय राधा जय राधा हमारो धन राधा जय राधा जय राधे जय राधे राधे जय राधे जय राधे जय राधे जय राधे राधे जय राधे जय राधे 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 जय राधे 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 जय राधे राधे जय राधे जय राधे राधे जय राधे जय राधे जय राधे जय राधे 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 जय राधे 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 so well being in life is any 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 moment ready to appear in our life but we need to open the door window so it's being said that when we listen to do's and don'ts the do's actually mean opening that window for well being and don't don't means you're closing the window for harmful situations in life केशव धृत मीन शरीर जय गोविंद हरे वेर ए पर्सन हैज अ टर्मोइल इन इज थॉट दैट मोमेंट ओपन द स्क्रिप्चर एंड वॉट एवर स्क्रिप्चर से इज डू दैट विल ब्रिंग क्लैरिटी इन हैड बिकॉज देर इज ए फ्लड ऑफ सो मेनी आइडिया सो मेनी कॉन्सेप्ट थिंग्स suggestions advices 
is actually bringing confusion in human head but the human has to be human head has to be filled with wisdom knowledge is information knowledge is information how many how many hair on your head this is knowledge how many how many trees on this earth you can know this thing but it has nothing to do to for personal satisfaction in life therefore wisdom is needed wisdom is something that it gets digested you can you can follow it in your action wisdom is something like you see the two types of food let's say edible the cooking oil one is from the nature mustard seed oil sesame seeds oil olive oil you know nature processed it other types of oil made from vegetable other things is hard for body but from from nature this is easy for body to digest similarly what is scripture suggest advice this wisdom and very easily your behavior can digest it because a scripture is such an experiment formula that what a what a person could not practice was not put in the scripture that's how you see the all the asanas can be performed all the pranayam can be done all the kundendu those sanskrit texts can be remembered if not not digestible wisdom digestible and information to dwell in information this is hard when wisdom comes at trouble times it will clear the head of a person there is being said that sometime a person sitting down and thinking what will be good for me in life in future and one is scared that i should not make the wrong decision that moment brush aside everything sit down and and chant mantras om namo bhagavate vasudevaya and after the minutes chanting then you think and you see the right decision will come because whatever variety we see in this life has come from one source of life and to connect to that source the only bridge only wave is mantra om namo narayana you connected to the source of life where nobody can reach you reached and all whatever you are seeking at that time that answer will come from there that, that's why before eating chant before sleeping chant the scripture says even before trying for a child conceive trying to conceive chant before any activities except going for toilet chant because the light and direction is from there what it needs just invocation well being is waiting for invocation kesav dhrit su kar roop jay govind hari nothing big is more important nothing is small is not important give important to every situation because is contributing for the holding of life and when a person works hard then naturally the things the places people and good health and his fame and money everything will come but when it comes nobody should say this is mine it belongs to life it belongs to time it belongs to the source of life this way to maintain peace in life because nothing is mine i'm just a caretaker i'm not a possessor i am not protector also who am i even in relationships you know, i am a caretaker of my father or or the mother or the wife or the husband or children or whatever or my money or everything belongs to the source of life i am a caretaker so the fear of loss will not come 
there is being said that always always observe humbleness because humbleness is something which will bring treasures from this life in that bag of humbleness and when humbleness remains in this head then a person does not decide wrongly ego makes a person decide wrongly one has to be disciplinary in life observe discipline the biggest discipline is this that actually nothing is mine everything belongs to life this is the hardest of discipline to understand that the compassion and remaining under the boundary inside the boundary of the eight steps of yoga these two things are strength enough very nicely to run this life compassion and the discipline of yam and niyam this is enough this anxiety aggression violence making loud not necessary this burns life actually keshav dhrit hal dhar roop jay govind hare listen to satsang on a daily basis because satsang does not compromise if it has to say something bitter it will say bitter imagine your life who can tell you bitter thing nobody can tell satsang and the bitter thing goes from inside from this ear and plows the field of our understanding when the that because whatever we are doing every day successfully we are sleeping getting up taking bath it creates one more layer of ego and one day a dangerous point will come where person will say i know never say i know say i'm trying to learn you know i'm trying to learn i don't know the knower is the scripture so the sharp things will plow the field of understanding and a person looks and throws the unwanted undesired things outside leaving the soil of understanding soft and this way heart is 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 able to dip the brain and mind in its nectar and a person comes in the activity of right destination in his life of looking at life love consciousness acceptance surrender nurturing and being a caretaker of this life the right behavior invokes immediately when the brain dipped in the nectar of heart keshav dhrit hal dhar roop jay govind hare everybody should live intelligently in life and intelligence is something which does not harm the other and does not harm himself also this is intelligence intelligence which brings acceptance surrender nurture healing satisfaction peace that instrument is called intelligence and as we see this life going on very quickly the only savior for this human being will be to come in the boundary of a yogic lifestyle like you saw in the time of covid who whoever could do bhastrika or pranayam or cinnamon or black pepper or some ginger all the yoga exercise were full on medicine not working and keep on washing your hand whole day don't put your finger in your nose don't scratch your head means above above this neck do not bring your hand above neck dangerous so it's like a priest you know priest working in a temple whole day washing his hand clean clothes nobody can touch you don't do this do that and that's what people were doing only life style will save so during this course ttc you have the savior in your pocket the life is life style because the first of all a person should think about oneself that how to survive emotionally physically 
spiritually whichever way how to survive where is the instrument the like right lifestyle where it is in your ttc manual govind jay jay mero gopal jay jay radha ravan hari govind jay har brahm ji ki aarti jo koi nar gaave swami jo koi nar gaave kahat shivanand swami मन वांछित फल पावे ओ जय गोविंद हरे जय गोविंद हरे स्वामी जय गोविंद हरे भक्त जनों के संकट दास जनों के संकट क्षण में दूर रहे ओ जय गोविंद जय गोविंद now other problem in life is anxiety so scripture bhagavatam says that the first point of anxiety is one says that what i wanted i didn't get this is the tragedy of my life what i wanted i didn't get then second step comes second point comes that what i wanted i never got what i wanted i never got what i got i never wanted and I, a good life time of life is spent goes in these two things one is justifying one's sadness <laughs> on these two grounds but later on compromise comes in life whatever wanted unwanted but i must not lose it compromise comes i must not lose it the fear of losing is the top of anxiety how to remove if this is removed if fear of lose losing is removed then a person lives li- with a liberated understanding in life यावत सका सक्युरवेशते कृतः प्रजा विसर्गे विभजामि भोजनम अविक्लवस्ते परिकर्मणे स्थितो मामे समुन्नद्धमदो जमानिनः सो नेक्स्ट टॉपिक इज अबाउट रिमूविंग दिस फियर ऑफ लूजिंग बिफोर द क्रिएशन ऑफ दिस बॉडी द क्रिएटर नारायण इज स्लीपिंग ऑन द ओशन ग्रेट बेड ऑफ ओशन and suddenly from his navel comes out the creator of this body brahma sitting on the on the lotus coming out of the navel of the the creator so brahma is looking four sides he he receives four faces so he is searching how to create how to create how to create and he very quickly all the knowledge flew into him that five element and seven type of metal and five types of fire and air and everything it all flew in him, in him but something he could not know for that he prayed o oh, om namo narayana i pray to the one divine resting in my heart please please awaken Oh, please appear i want to ask you on a little prayer narayan appears the whole bed of ocean is filled with beautiful perfume and light so brahma brahma is saying that you created me to create the body of human being and this human being will be different from other bodies it will have intelligence it will have freedom to decide and also have memory bank so something some hidden truth as a secret to be put there so when whatever type of complication come in a human life and if a person taps on that compartment 
the solution to that any given situation will be will come up that i don't know so just like you tell a house maker please make this house this way this way this way and make sure that i am peaceful in this house 365 days the house maker will say i will do everything else but this i don't know that you will be peaceful the whole year i don't i don't know so brahma says i don't know that jnanam paramoyam me yad vigyan samanvitam sarahasyam dadangam jagrihan gaditam maya so narayan says brahma you take my wisdom which is deep and which is scientific everything is scientific means you're doing aarti you're putting down your head in front of the altar immense benefit all these things have but till now we don't know the benefit one day we'll know but leave aside everything shraddhavan labhate if you put down your head on the ground in front of the altar or in front of the book that is a life saver mean in front of the harmonious posture if a person will not bend down where will it bend down when we listen to scripture the well being is flying in the body of words inside us such a neutral unbiased no oh, and totally for our well being words will not we will not find anywhere we will not find an advice and a suggestion which does not make us dance this is scripture and this is an immense benefit of every human being that keeps he keeps his head surrendered in that situation towards the scripture and towards the altar when this this surrender will go away then ego will take over govind jay jay gopal jay jay radha raman hari govind jay jay so narayan is saying brahma write that secret write that before before the creation the creator is saying i am there when the creation is there i am there when the creation will break the name and form will break what will remain is me just like when a pot is made out of clay before it is made it is clay when the pot is made it is clay and when it is broken it is clay in between came name and form the clay was given a form it can hold water and it was given a name so one can say oh can you give me some water from the clay from the pot otherwise how to hold water and how to tell somebody can you give me some water from the clay problem so similarly rudeyardham yad pratiyet na pratiyet cha atmani tad vidyadat mano mayam yatha bhaso yatha tamah appearance is different real is behind it appearance just for the sake of behavior everybody's face looks different fingerprint this that that but inside everybody is one all these different faces different fingerprints and everything why maybe when is a time up for a person so death comes and one person has to go but everybody looks similar the problem maybe just for convenience of passport officer no <laughs> different otherwise how to differentiate there means there is a good quantity of people in this world who look same put your two fingers passport officer three fingers for the convenience of <clears throat> behavior rudeyam yad pratiyet 
If there is a scare in life that I might not lose, it's only about a name and a form. The appearance must not change. Ahar nisham gimbar chindaniyam sansar mithyat vashivat mutatvam Day and night, day and night, one has to remind oneself of the momentariness of the change in appearance. When you look in the mirror, you're brushing your teeth. Remember, remind yourself that however nicely you brush, but the teeth, tooth is going to fall. One, one day a person will stand with a toothbrush and toothpaste on it, but there will be no teeth inside. I'm ready to do my karma, but nobody will receive. So a person will become selfish that if everything is going to fall, why to waste money on toothpaste? This also takes money. But answer comes, this is duty. Mouth is an area of duty. You have to keep it clean, whether tooth or no tooth. This discussion does not arise. This is the definition of duty where you are looking after, but the situation will not look after you, will not look back. Similarly, when you are putting cream on your cheek, beautiful cheek, remember, this skin is going to fall, it will hang. But still a person does, my cheek, my skin, my truth, I love my toothless mouth. How beautifully you put oil or shampoo, you know, hair loss shampoo. But hair will fall. Because body is wise. Everything from where it has come, it will go back also. The scientist is just finding that why apple fell on ground. The scientist is not finding how can I put back apple on the branch. Maybe in his private life he's trying to implant hair. That's another story. But in his profession, that it fell that much. His effort is not to put it back. No. To accept situations as they are is the success of that mechanism. That's why it's Science is so successful because it does not cross its boundary. Similarly for human being also. The yogic practices, scripture, spirituality, everything will be totally successful. It will bring 100% shine in human life, but he is trying to implant hair. Now I am not against it, but as it is, accept as it is. Lady went to a barber with three hair on her head. So Barbara was professional. She said, Madam, which kind of style you will like today? So she said, that kind. Well, he is trying to do that. The one hair fell. So only two. Madam, there are only two. What to do? The lady didn't give up. She said, that type. So Barbara was trying, and one more hair fell. So she said, Barbara said, only one hair now, Madam. What to do with this? What style you will like? So lady thought and thought and then said, let it be. Let it be. She would have done it before also. So to accept the situation as it is, this is liberation. That this is here, but it will have drastic change in appearance. Why? Because it is nature. To look at things as they are, is the definition of knowledge. To look at things as they are not is the definition of ignorance. Chidanand Rupa Shivoham Shivoham Even if you look in the mirror and ask yourself, who are you? Ask yourself, who am I? You will see your name. Mirror will say, this is your name. Then you, my face, or oh, this is your face is ch ever changing. Then you tell mirror, oh, you know that person is my father. Oh, this is your relation. Who are you? Or you see that I live in that house. Oh, this is your address. Who are you? 
then you give your thumbprint oh this is your thumbprint who are you so mirror will go on asking who are you he the mirror will push you against the wall there will be identity crisis who am i whatever identity i give this is your name this is your form this is your address this is your relation this is your possession who am i this is a problem chidanand roop है तारों और सितारों में प्रकाश जिसका है चांद और सूरज में आभास जिसका वही सच्चिदानंद अमर आत्मा हूं मैं वे माई वॉट इज शाइनिंग इन द मून एंड स्टार्स एंड सन and moon that shine that's what i am because as you know that the life on this earth in this human being is coming from stars we can we can smile because star is supplying the energy anything thinking emotion emote mathematics music horse riding and the energy is coming for that from a star science is on it which is the first star the research the search is on this point now which is the first star which is supplying everything anadi radi govind sarva karana karanam ishwara parama krishna sachidananda vigraha finding first star that will mean that the reason of all reasons the reason of all reasons now you can use your head and think about what should be the reason of all reasons you can press your creativity a little bit that this creation came into being all all so many reasons but what is the reason behind all these reasons the scripture says love consciousness is the first star from there everything is coming and everything goes in that be a matter of time anadi radi govind the beginning less in this life is love consciousness behind this nothing just for example if you ask a mother why you are giving birth to child she will say out of love so what is the reason for this love or no i am i am love what is the reason behind love there is no reason if there is a reason behind love love will vanish if anything has a reason behind it will vanish anything has a condition the situation will vanish that's where there is a combination unconditional love that is the first star the scripture already says this so fear of losing but when a person comes in real identity he priya sawahi jahan lagi prani if somebody ask you who are you you should give answer that i am the person who is liked by everybody i am the person who is liked by everybody or you can say i'm love because you can say i accept you as you are beyond your capabilities or incapabilities if you meet one a person one person like that who tells you like that you will never forget that person because in life we know so many people but remember only one or two where the acceptance was there beyond mind and brain beyond ego and desires man muskaan hi ram sun bani and you this way with this answer you will amuse other person's heart bringing amusement to heart very necessary heart is feeling bored 
Because whenever we give right answers, we engage in right activities, then heart is amused. Oh, this person is in the right line of bliss, everlasting happiness. Govind Jai Jai Mero Gopal Jai Jai Radharam Hari Govind Jai Jai In a village somewhere there was a teenager boy and he was not behaving like a teenage sitting quietly, not talking, not playing ball, this, that. So his father <clears throat> His father got worried that maybe he becomes mute, doesn't speak in life. So one day when very big scholar, saint was passing by, so this father brought the child in front of this saint scholar and said, Sir, that can you do some magic so he starts speaking and behaving like a teenage? So the saint scholar said, okay, ask the boy, what is your name? from where you come, what you do and what is your hobby. These are the questions you must have exchanged between yourself. From where you come, what you do and what is your hobby, what is your name? Naham manushyo na yaksho The child is blind. He said, I am not human being. I cannot be categorized in any kind of a species. I am not a warrior. I am not a scholar. I am not a, uh, a business maker. I am not a service maker. I am not celibate. I am not a family person, I am not a renunciate, I am not a sannyas, a give, give up, giving up. I am not a renunciate. I am not king, I am not beggar either. And my name is Soul. I didn't come from anywhere. I didn't come from anywhere. And my hobby is to all the time sip my true identity from my soul. That means bliss. This is what I do and this is my, my hobby. Like you say, I'm a yoga teacher and this is my hobby also. This is my profession and this is my hobby. Govind Jai Jai Gopal So you see such a liberated answer. It's today's situation and nobody wants to brand, stamp oneself in this category. That category means what means what is your gender male female although people write not applicable <laughs> that liberty some nations have to you can put in the passport not applicable why should i categorize myself as being female or male otherwise no i am there this is not enough no hum manushyo na jadev yakshyo I cannot be categorized by my profession also. I am beyond that. I am. I am. I am soul. Always here. Never go anywhere. And every moment I relish my true identity. So this scholar saint became impressed. And he told the father that your son is actually wasting, your, wasting his time here. Extraordinary child, you give him to him, me. The father got attached. He, the father thought I did a mistake of introducing the child to the... But then, all the whole city explained to the father that listen how much wisdom is sitting in your son. And the scholar is standing in front who will ignite that wisdom. So he agreed. He had three, four other sons, or he didn't have whatever. And a scholar, saint, took him, initiated him into scriptures, and the answer he gave to the saint. Now, this, this answer comes like a question in the, in the question paper of Indian philosophy examination 
for masters please explain the saint the saint named him hastmalak hastmalak means gooseberry in on the palm in the palm hastmalak question comes please explain in detail philosophy what was the philosophy behind hastmalak answer in the masters this question comes hari krishna hari krishna 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 hari hari to be something called liberation to be in liberation means that you understood the illusion of physical situation it remains like one for a long time but suddenly flips but to be aware of that situation to be in moksha liberation the moment we 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 lose lose it we are in illusion yatha mahanti bhutani bhuteshu cha vacheshvanu pravishtani pravishtani tatha deshu na deshu etavadev jigyasyam tatv jigyasunatmana anuvaya vyatireka bhyam yadasyat sarvatra sarvada the moment we accept the momentary ness the change in the appearance of momentary ness there is no fear of loss because whether i want or not everything is changing its appearance appearance is not real the real is behind appearance it can be realized but not perceived what matter is realization which hits on the feeling but appearance may hit just the brain or mind but that is very local you know there's not much of importance so slowly slowly this way a person will detach oneself from the physical appearance fear will go away and lot of stability and peace will come inside his eyes will take the shape of lotus eye and this person wherever he sits it becomes a thousand petal lotus flower blooms in his head wherever he will sit he will decorate the situation no anxiety inside no fear of loss he decorates the situation the situation does not decorate him any more edava dev jagyasyam tatva jagyasunatmana you see this is freedom till yesterday a person is searching what situation should i create so it will decorate me but today wherever whichever time whatever situation sits in he decorates it with his peace which came from a logical and factual situation that the whole moment in us is a change it's there but it's change behind that real that's what i am i am love loved by everybody this is my identity and the time cannot shape or reshape it चिदानंद 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 हम हर हाल में हम मस्त चिदानंद 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 हम हर हाल में हम मस्त चिदानंद 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 हम चिदानंद 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 हर हाल में हम मस्त चिदानंद चिदानंद रूप शिवो हम शिवो हम चिदानंद रूप शिवो हम शिवो हम शिवो हम शिवो हम शिवो हम चिदानंद रूप शिवो हम शिवो हम शिवो हम शिवो हम शिवो हम शिवो हम चिदानंद रूप शिवो this part's lesson is at moment in as always keep in location the change in the moment in as it changes so there actually the whole ground of fearing falls down because it was standing on this name this form was not change but we want or not want it's changing this shifts us on the ground of our soul which is 
not changing ever always there and a person's actually the real profession or the hobby or pastime he will put through understanding put the straw in his soul sip it atma ramo bhavati this way he is mr soul jay jay sri radhe bolo aaj ke anand ki jai pause here for now thank you
Yeah. Okay.